up guys it's your girl jewel here with my 23 for 23 healthy lifestyle change um and today i had a talk with one of my co-workers and i was telling her how you know i was really interested in being a vegan and i wanted to figure out you know what necessary nutrition i needed to get so i wouldn't be malnourished you know and you know still had my protein intake and all these things so I can you know be vegan but still be healthy you know because um and one of the reasons I haven't made the transition is because I really don't know too much about being vegan um I'm not sure if I'm ready um because I, I need to know everything before going into it but you know I do try different meal options just to test it out um while I'm making this transition but I was telling her how you know I love ice cream and one I just really don't want to have to give up ice cream like vegan is great uh, meat you know whatever um but I love ice cream and then she was like so eat the ice cream <laughs> and I'm like yeah but it's dairy you know and she's like so what she was like why do you have to call yourself vegan you know you can still not eat all these foods, not eat cheese, not eat milk, and eat your ice cream because that's what you want. And I'm like, you don't understand how my life just changed because I'm just like, I have to give it all up. She said it doesn't have to be an or. There's an and. You can make that and. You can choose what you want your life to be. If you want to eat some meat once a year, go for it. Nobody can tell you who to be or what to do. And I'm just like, you're absolutely right. And in my head, I was just thinking because, you know, if you're vegan, don't be halfway in it. You know what I'm saying? But she was like, well, why are you calling yourself vegan? Like, you don't have to call yourself that. That's, you know, it's not a thing. And what it made me realize was I had put myself in this box, which is what most people do. They conform to the box that society gives them and they think that that is what they are supposed to be when in reality the box does not exist and when you come to realize that you can be who you want to be do what you want to do go where you want to go have what you want to have then the box disappears and so when she told me like just if you want the ice cream eat the ice cream if you want the seafood eat the seafood you know what I'm saying you cannot eat this be this you know and you can have both you know what i'm saying if you prefer to get rid of food i'll get rid of me do it and then if you want to eat ice cream that day eat the ice cream so um and it's funny because i just got back from florida and i was with my friend and she's you know she's trying to lose weight and she was like you know sometimes i look in the mirror and i feel like oh girl i'm hot and then sometimes I look in the mirror and I'm like, ugh, that's not how it's supposed to look. And here I am telling her, you know, there's no such thing as it's supposed to look like this. There's no supposed to look like. Um, there's no perfect body. There's no perfect way to look. There's no perfect person to be. I, be the person that you're meant to be. Strive the best. Strive to be the best you that you can be and enjoy who you are during the process of trying to lose weight and then that will get you to your end goal of actually losing weight but when you start thinking that there is a certain way you're supposed to look it makes you harder to achieve that because it's not necessarily going to look like that and i said all that to say i was preaching to her about how you know not to conform to society and what they believe to be perfect and, he, and I'm like I can't do vegan because I love ice cream because society told me that um, in order to be vegan I can't eat this can't eat that granted I will I won't be vegan if I do however who cares you know um, there's no straight and narrow path to being the person that you want to be to getting success to reaching your goals nothing is gonna go straight away if you have a straight away life where it was boom 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 then i don't even think you lived um so nothing is gonna be perfect nothing is gonna be the way that 
the world wants it to be but as long as it's something that you want it to be as long as it's something that you enjoy as long as it's something that your body likes then go for it do it and don't worry about the box that really does not exist all right guys i'll see y'all next time Thank you.